Hi people, how are we doing? Um, just going to do this video on how to remove your headlights on an MR2 Roadster. Um, so, first of all you've got to remove the plastic um, cover inside the engine there. Um, they have plastic rivets dotted around. Um, so I've just taken those out all around the edge, both sides, um, using a flathead screwdriver. Um, be ideal to remove your spare wheel cover so you can lift that up lifts out you can see got the plastic hinges plastic hinges on the back so then your plastic cover will come off just lift it forward Got some little cutouts so it's sort of hooked in. Lift that up. Nice and clear on the top. You got a Phillips there, or you can use a socket, it's probably a 10mm socket. Uh, and you use your Phillips screwdriver there. And then the tricky one is going to be down in the bottom corner. So, in order to get access to that, you've got to take off your wheel. And then you need to peel back the, uh, the shielding inside the wheel arch. Um, you've got some of the plastic clips. I've just pulled out two of these. Um, and then you can see, hopefully, there is inside there at the back. All right, let's get extra light in there. I've got the socket on it. So I've got two of the, the smaller size sockets, put the two of them together with a, a 10 mil socket on the end because you've got a 10 mil nut that you've got to get to. So once I've done that and took that out, then the headlight should come straight out. Um, I also, I did loosen off this part of the bumper. So um, there's four bolts. 10 mil heads on them took them out so i'm going to take that nut out and then hopefully finally uh got the headlamp out um required a bit more jiggling or first thought you basically have to loosen the front part of the bumper there was a screw um let's just see where my finger is see my finger is right there that was going up that was being secured uh, then I had to loosen some more small bolts underneath. So you can see under the front there's one there and then one around the other side. So basically you just got to loosen as many bolts as you can on the under under trays. Um, so you get enough movement on the front bumper because uh, part of the headlight front headlight tucks underneath there to secure it in place so uh, you only actually have three bolts holding your headlight in place but it's just removing the trim so you can get it out in one piece, one piece ready to put your new headlight in so uh, then removing the bits of plastic the plastic connectors um, got a squeezy bit on the back but they, uh, they haven't got a lot of play in them, so they're a bit of a nightmare. Just need a bit of persuading with a flat edge screwdriver, pop them out, and then uh, you'll be able to wriggle your headlight out. I must say, the first thing you've got to do when you're putting them back in is get this bottom screw. Okay, you must get that screw in first. Uh, just do it finger tight. You see it up there on the left, 10 mil socket. Get that in and then uh, line it up obviously with your bumper out because your bumper then tucks underneath the headlight you can see a little bit of plastic there goes underneath the headlight and then obviously you've got your other two fixings there and there to get it in uh, but it's quite easy to put it back together um, as you see in the earlier part of the video okay thanks for watching please subscribe 